today we are at the Glen Stewart Ravine in downtown Toronto and people say this is one of the only really common relaxing places in the city because it's really isolated from everywhere else. There are lots of little streams and rivers and it, stairs and stuff like that so who knows let's see what this uh, brings us. So when you're coming off all these like bridges and stuff, there are huge, huge hills. So just try and stay on the trail as much as possible because you really don't want to go down there. Well, at least I don't think you want to go down there. So there are a lot of stairs here, we are just headed up these and you can see the staircase goes on and on for who knows how long, but we're hiking up it, it's good exercise. So once you come up these stairs it actually takes you out into a little park out which looks like it's the end of the ravine, so that's pretty much what you can expect to find. We walk from here all the way down here. We didn't do this, but that's okay because there was construction right here. So we went all the way from up here to down here, which is pretty cool. So at the start and end of the ravine, I didn't talk about it before, but there's these signs and they tell you about every different kind of leaf, tree and stuff like that. They tell you about the birds, which is cool, and just some little history on the actual ravine and forest area itself. One thing you might want to do, which I did not, is wear some really close toe sandals or preferably running shoes because there is a lot of hiking up hills and you can see I'm just wearing my slides, so yeah. 